Bruh. I mean, at least we fired somebody, right? I mean, it's not the person we really wanted or needed it to be, but that that's that's who they decided to go with. Oh, and not they. I don't mean they. You know, you, you feel me? Because you know, Joe Douglas didn't fire him like he's supposed to because he's the GM. Because that's what normal organizations do. You know, that's how the structure is. Players, head coach. Uh, GM and then owner, you know, instead of just, you know, coach and then owner and GM, then owner and whoever else can talk to the owner because the owner's too fucking stupid to know what the fuck he's doing. Like, how, how do we fire Greg Williams, who I don't believe did a bad job? I don't care what nobody say, bro. I, like, you, you're not going to win games if you can't score. Like, yeah, I guess defense is important it's very important because if you don't got a defense people are going to run over you but when you have a offensive guru genius the greatest offensive coach ever you feels me the guy who made Peyton Manny who he's supposed to be supposedly is your head coach you, you, you just can't get that you feel me you 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 can't get that right like us as Jeff fans we, we can't get none of that no nah, good things can't happen to us because for whatever reason, like, I don't know what pictures or what type of blackmail shit is going on at MetLife where the, at, I, Adam Gates got pictures of Christopher Johnson doing some shit he's not supposed to be doing because there's no way he still has a job right now. Not only does he still have his job, but he's taking other people's jobs away. Like, wh what? How, how is that even a thing? Why is that a thing? Like I really, I really think in Christopher Johnson's head, he's sitting there looking at everything. It's not Adam's fault. Nope, I wasn't wrong about my hire. Nah, Peyton Manny would never do anything to screw us over, right? No, not Peyton Manny. No, not the one who didn't want to play for us. Who who said ah, I'd rather go back to school than play for the Jets, or whose little brother plays for the damn Giants? Like, the your your. Rival, not even a rival team, because I wouldn't even call them rivals, bro. There, there's no, it's no question about. There's no fucking rivals. Niggas don't give a damn about no damn Snoopy Trophy. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. All right. You, the little brother of the face of the franchise, who's just retired. Who's just retired. So of course he wants to protect his little brother's legacy as long as possible. Because I think if Sam Darnold would have had a good coach, we wouldn't be in this predicament. I see Sam Darnold winning Super Bowls, bro. Multiple, not just one. All right? I believed in him that much. I believed in him that much. I did. We all did. And then Adam Gase came and just ruined him. Like, like he single-handedly ruined a whole French. Oh, my God. And then you give him the right. You give him the power to defy your people. And from what I hear, what they're reporting, I rather, that everybody signed off for this? Joe Douglas, you signed off for this? Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Like, they really got together and said, Greg's the problem. When we, we, this is the, we haven't scored a touchdown in how long, bro? Up until now? We're like, what, 0 for 11 and and we just now scoring touchdowns? Are you fucking kidding me? Like, you really... Bro, like, what the fuck? What team does this, bro? Like, what team does this? What team does this, bro? Like, what the fuck? I am a Knicks fan, bro. I know about bad decisions with teams, bro. I dealt with Derek Fisher. I've dealt with David Fisdale. I've dealt with some of the worst coaches you can imagine. Gaze, Gaze tops the cake, everything, bro. Like, come on, son. Come on. Like, it doesn't make a lick of sense. Somebody make it make sense to me. People are idiots in the comments talking about it makes no sense to fire him now. But it makes sense to fire Greg Williams? Y'all really sat there and used that man as a scapegoat? Listen, Greg Williams probably yesterday single-handedly saved the franchise. Because I don't believe we win another game, especially now that he's not here. Like our defense wasn't wasn't that good, but like at least we had something with him. You gonna blame the defensive coordinator because you can't score? 
Bro, Adam Gase couldn't score if he was on the one yard line running against fucking handicapped kids, bro. Like, no disrespect to handicapped kids or anything like that. But what the f- Bro. This is the worst coach I've ever seen in my fucking life, bro. And they, this is what, <laughs> I can't even speak. Like, I can't speak, bro. This shit is so frustrating. It's so frustrating, bro. Jets fans know exactly how I feel right now, bro. They understand it. This is some bullshit. <laughs> like, what the fuck? What other team goes through this, bro? See, the Jets are the team that you want, that you need to have in your division so you could build dynasties, bro. Because they will consistently do stupid shit over and over and over again, bro. Like, this is the only team that doesn't believe Adam Gay should go. The only team. Like, it really scares me, bro. Like, I don't even have faith that they're going to fire this dude after the season's over. You let him fire somebody, him, who the one, he doesn't even, he's the one that needs to get fired. He's the one doing a horrible job, at it, a horrible job as a head coach. He's doing the worst, and you let him fire somebody that was doing a better job than him? Make that make sense to me, please. Somebody. Like, what the fuck? Bro, I'm, this is terrible, bro. This is terrible. This is horrible. I, bro, I, can't, I, can't, I can't even speak, bro. Like, why? It's <laughs> just why? Like, what? I, I really want to really have just a, not even a talk. Just, I just want to be, you could make me a mute in a room. Just put me in the corner somewhere and just let me listen to the bull crap that goes on with them. Like what made them think that this is a good time to fire him now? You're not going to fire the real problem, the real cancer of this whole situation, but you're going to fire Greg Williams. Now I'm not defending his play call or anything like that, but we know who Greg Williams is, bro. And we wouldn't have that problem if. The fucking ball wasn't getting picked off every two seconds. Or we just, you know, punt, 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 punt. If you're a punter or a kicker, Adam Gates is the best coach you can absolutely have. Because that's the only thing he's going to do. He's going to make your punter a Hall of Famer, bro. I swear. This is like, bro, like what the fuck? What in the hell is going on? <laughs> Like, your fan base is begging you, pleading with you. We will do anything. I will buy every single product of Johnson & Johnson I possibly can if they just fire Adam Gaze. But no. Like, they really believe that he's the shit. He's the one that's going to, like, he really believes that shit. Like, and I can't even be optimistic. Op I can't even fucking speak, bro. I can't even be happy about the chance of us getting Trevor Lawrence, bro. Because the Jets have never had a, a first-round pick since I've been alive, okay? They, since I've been alive, I've never seen him with a first-round pick. I've never seen the build-up like this, I, especially dealing with Trevor Lawrence if he if he becomes who they said he's going to become. But how can you be happy when you're not even sure your team is going to fire the fucking coach? Like, what? What the what? Like, what? What sense does this shit make? Like, I can't, bro. I can't. I gotta. I gotta, I gotta smoke a spliff. I gotta watch anime. I gotta get my mind off of this shit. I'm yelling. I'm gonna catch a heart attack, bro. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look 45, and I'm not even 25, my nigga. Like, come on, bro. Like, th this team is so fuck. It doesn't make sense to me, bro. It doesn't. It really doesn't, bro. I, that That's all I got, bro. That's all I got for now. Hopefully, if something else happens, I'll come back. It, just what the... What in the fuck? I, I, the Jet, Jet, I'm sorry, Jets fans. All right? Uh, uh, mutual Jets fans. You know, we, we know what the fuck is going on, bro. This is some bullshit, all right? I, I hope you enjoy the rant or whatever. I know I sound stupid and crazy, but whatever, bro. This is how I'm feeling. I'm just shooting that shit out because I'm going to fucking hurt somebody, bro. Like, I'm going to. But just... Oh, my God, bro. And I still don't got no damn PlayStation 5. So you know I'm fucked up right now. 
J J E T S Jets Jets. Who gives a goddamn? Fire Adam Gase. Fire him. Fire please please do something. Get him out of here. Like dude, please don't. All right, I'm I'm out. I I can't. This is bull. This is so fucking sad. 